like comments. But in this next topic, a little quick PSA. It looks like Tesla has made some updates to their Tesla app with supercharging prices and supercharging wait times. This is very useful because we always want to know. I can't usually when I get into my Tesla and I want to go to a supercharger, I have to wait all the way until I get in and see what uh, supercharger I can actually go into. So this is really useful because now I can pre plan just a little bit to see what is on my route. But if you're just joining in, my name is Dennis. I love talking about Tesla hacking as I like to call it, but basically just getting the best thing on Tesla at the best financing rate so definitely hit that subscribe if you're interested and so let us take a look at this shout out to nada not a tesla app for actually releasing this looks like tesla adds supercharger prices and wait times to the tesla app so you can take a look right here uh, just like how you see these exact screens in your tesla vehicle when you click on a supercharger you can now actually see the different costs because it's also time of use based upon what time you actually get there it's higher rate versus lower rates and this is actually like pretty crazy, right? 23 cents to 46 cents in California. And now we can also see the wait time. Some of them are also busier, but I think this is more so of a problem in metropolitan cities, like especially California, where these places, these superchargers can definitely get backed up. And you can see right here, this one has a five minute wait time. The cool thing with this is you could probably preload your destination as well. And so that, because I don't know if you've noticed when you try and drive to a Tesla supercharger, your Tesla preconditions its back batteries for optimal charging and also pre good preconditions it so it doesn't necessarily ruin the battery as well because supercharging is a high rate of speed and potentially a higher hot um charging speed. So this is definitely some cool features, a nice feature that Tesla has added. If you haven't messed with it, definitely update your Tesla app and check it out. But we're going to jump into the live stream comments. But before we do that, this video is like sponsored by my Patreon link. So definitely check it out if you're interested.